Hello, 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 everyone. I'm a little early. It's 10.01. I meant to go live at like 9.59, um, but I got distracted by the internet up until then. And turns out setup takes about two minutes <laughs> for me, usually. Um, and most of that time is thinking of a title. So, I'm ready for some Sims today. Um, I'm trying to decide if I even want to leave the house at all today, because it is kind of grossed out again. Um, and I could just take it as a day off from the gym. Um, we'll see. We'll see what I do. Actually, no, I do need to go get snacks today. Ugh, that's unfortunate. I do need to leave the house at some point today. Good morning, Cozy. How are you doing this morning? Well, it's afternoon for you. <laughs> How's your afternoon so far? We made it to the weekend. Oh my god. Thank freaking god it's Saturday. I, I don't think I could take work in a day, honestly. It's a Sims all day sort of day. I was just dis discussing with myself whether or not I wanted to even leave the house at all today, but I kind of have to. I have to grocery shop. Eating lead paint. Well, I don't recommend that, Nether. Um, <laughs> I I would say stick stick to cheese, probably. Um, <laughs> oh no, that's no good. It's gone yellow. Like, the color of it changed? Or, like, there's, like, yellow, like, liquid coming from it? Either way, not great. I hope he's alright. Oh Charles is being very clingy this morning. He's already on my lap. We have our little baby. What's his name again? Who is this? Jasper, right. <laughs> <laughs> the color has changed. That's weird. I don't think I've ever heard of that in a cat. I hope he's alright. Very cool if he is alright. Um, just like he was just like, I'm bored of this eye color. <laughs> you know? <laughs> um, but, yeah, I wonder, I wonder what that means. That's so strange. Because he, he has green eyes like Charles, usually, right? I've never heard of that. Okay, you were asleep, rightfully. It is 10 a.m. I don't know why you're not more asleep, frankly. Bianca, you should probably be asleep for a little bit. But you are hacking the land grab systems. Actually, go to sleep for a little bit. Vikram. Pian. Yeah, that makes sense. That is a good thing for you to do. And you are... It looks like you were doing a cross-stitching. The fox one. That's right. Resume that. Okay. Go team. The eye on the right. Oh, let me see. Oh. Oh, very strange. Yeah, it looks like it just kind of, like, lost a little color. Oh, I hope he's okay. Yeah. That's so weird. It kind of looks like that, like... Because he's got, like, lighter green on the outside, and then there's, like, a ring of darker green, and then the, the pupil. It looks like he lost the ring of darker green, and it just, like, paled out, you know? That's so strange. Oh, I hope he's okay. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Did you, um... Did you call the vet? Are you, like, waiting for results or something, or, um... Like, what do you mean by waiting on the vet? <laughs> but yeah, at least he's not acting different. But that's still, that's even stranger, honestly. Yeah. I feel like that would make me worry more. Not to exacerbate the worries, but <laughs> I, I get so strange about pet and like anything that changes in a pet. I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, they're dying. Like, <laughs> Nico, good afternoon. Welcome back in with the nine month subscription. We have a Twitch baby. That's, in, that's incredible. It feels like it's been like a year. 
honestly, nine months. Welcome in. I hope you're having an all right afternoon. It's the weekend, thank God. Um, Vikram, you need to cook three gourmet dishes at a single event. Oh my god. It's gonna be, oh my god, I think today is the year that you followed, Cozy. Like, a hundred, like, today. Because I'm pretty sure it was March 11th. Let me, I'm clicking on your name right now. Following since March 11th. Oh my god. <laughs> it's been a full year. Yeah, time really does fly when you're having fun. That's crazy. Well, thank you for a full year of support, Cozy. Legitimately incredible. Um, oh, I want Raul to finish this aspiration, but I really don't think he's gonna... He dies kind of... He might die during this stream, frankly. <laughs> One year anniversary. Ugh. Time is so strange, but it's it's wild. Can't get rid of you that easy. Not that I would ever even try, Cozy. <laughs> He's halfway through young adulthood, too? Goddamn. Watch a romance? No. What you need to do, my guy is watch culinary training videos so that you can get your performance up at work. <laughs> Welcome on in, Twisted. How you doing this morning? Yeah, I don't, I'm lucky that I chose a name that I think is going to stick around for a long time. I don't think I ever need to change it, um, because I don't ever want to have to try a rebrand. <laughs> New packs, yes, you know, I almost did that this morning. Um, and by almost, I mean, I thought about doing it yesterday, and then this morning did not remember to do so. Um, <laughs> so... Maybe we'll do that later on, because they're having a sale right now, so. And also the website, I, I like, look through, and I don't, I don't know if they're also having a sale because of the sale. But, on the wrong account, I did notice that. <laughs> Which packs did you get, Cozy? Raul's feeling very flirty. Why are you feeling very flirty? What did you do? Oh, he loves cross-stitching. I'm glad I do. I, I have him do it often. Realm of Magic, Parenthood, and Spa Day. Ooh. Heck yeah. Spa Day seems like it's a fun one. Um, Dan and Phil played with that one. <laughs> you have another Fear of Death, Raul? God damn it. Well, what can we do? Catch a fish? We can have you go fishing. It's kind of raining out. I don't think you'll like it, but it's fine. Angle for the big catch for a moment. Ah. And you, you, yeah, you work late now again. I forgot about that. Cute magical cottage of, mel of magic. Heck yeah. The Roman magic one looks like it had some cute stuff too. Um, just aside from the, like, spell keeping thing seeming okay because i watched um little simsy play through the realm of magic one because she was like i always kind of hated it so i'm giving it a second try and it seems like the magic is pretty fun um a new world that will be pretty much just for building hell yeah i kind of want to at some point um build in that the third world there that's like completely empty i feel like it'd be fun to fill that up with house houses and maybe we'll do that on this save file. I don't know. Not the broken stereo. Replace it. We have the money. Also, welcome back, Twisted. How you doing this afternoon? Um... 
Our money has been slowly going down since Connor died, I have noticed. Just like little by little. Um... <laughs> A new sim, yeah. I actually have um, another save file where I have a sim that I just, like, randomized for building. I don't even remember what his name is, but I just randomized a sim, frankly. <laughs> if it was just for building, I don't care who, like, experiences the buildings, you know? That's where I'll do shell challenges if I ever do those. Charles, would you like to leave? Is that what you were telling me? I can let you out. <laughs> Go ahead. He's gonna come yowing and knocking on the door in like five minutes again. Regular cat stuff. <laughs> And yeah, I could never really get into create a sim. I like leaving them with their random oh, stuff because I think it, it's more indicative of their personality, honestly. Like if their if their outfit is horrendous, I will change it. Absolutely. But, <laughs> but I'm not gonna spend hours and create a sim like some people do, just to make like the perfect sim with the perfect eyebrows and like the height of the eyebrows on the face. Like, no. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna hit randomize, I'm gonna scooch it to where I like, and then we're good. <laughs> Bianca should probably wake up now. Okay. I thought I was having a stroke for a moment trying to read the title there. <laughs> I had to I had to look at the small text and be like, are all words like that for a moment? What the hell? Uh, <laughs> hey, great man, how's it going? How's your afternoon? Kerp that Jerse Kerman, that's what it is. Um, it does not read well. <laughs> not not having someone say it out loud does kind of ruin that type of voice. Um. Yeah, he can like mixology. <laughs> that was awful. Truly awful. Bianca, come take a shower. Come get leftovers. It's English, but it's like a it's like it's the her, 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 her type of talk that came from like early 2010s media. Um Stream for three hours and had some noodles. Heck yeah. Yeah, it takes a lot. Um, <laughs> it's why I never fully completed my Twitch channel. <laughs> um, you know how when you scroll down, some people have those like little blurbs of like about and like here's the donation box and all the top subscribers and all that. I just, uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I was like, no. Um, but I do have a friend who designs websites for companies, and I might him, hit him up at some point and be like, hey, like, would you like to design just my Twitch homepage <laughs> for me? Because <laughs> I, I can't be bothered. I can't do all that. <laughs> Raul caught the fish. We can now get the sphere be gone. And we can make him not afraid of death yet again. <laughs> it is a lot of effort. Drink the fear, be gone. Get rid of that fear of death. And then you can come home. Honestly. You don't have to fish out in the rain for that long. Ah, but you should say hello to Mangle on the way. Okay, you can come do laundry, because I think, yeah, it needs to go into the dryer. 
Hey, Panda, how you doing this afternoon? How was your Saturday? Which I've said it many times this stream already, but thank fucking god it's Saturday. <laughs> I don't think I could handle another weekday right now. Ugh, Charles is meowing in the basement again. He loves meowing in the basement. I don't know what it is about him. Every time I go over and I'm like, hey, like, what's what's the matter, buddy? What do you need? Like, is it the litter box, food, attention? Like, what do you need? He's like, nothing's wrong. It's all good. You know, he's happy. He's a purry cat. He's good. And then the second I turn away, he's back to meow. Yeah. <laughs> he's a little weirdo. He just likes meowing in the basement. Rebel's feeling confident. We're <laughs> yet again singing Itsy Bitsy Spider to this fox. <laughs> Wait, can you get gifts? Oh no, not from not from foxes. That's unfortunate. Well, let's give him a fish. Let's see if he likes a sturgeon. I too love meowing in the basement. I get it. Sometimes you just gotta yowl. <laughs> Oh, that sounds like it's outside my door, though. Would you like to come back in? Is that what I'm hearing now? <laughs> Speaking of being a weirdo... Hello again, Charles. You just left, like, five minutes ago. Would you like to come hang out? Come here. You were meowing so bad to get in here. Come on. This cat. Thank you. <laughs> okay. What were you up to, Vikram? What was happening here? What is happening here? Enthuse about the thrill of the steel and chat with Bianca. Bianca's chatting with the cat and eating dinner. Well, eating... Lunch, I guess. Vikram, come chat with Bianca, I guess. Talk about your dreams. Serenade. Raul just became good friends with Mangle. Oh, Charles, it is really hard to play the game with you doing this, you know? <laughs> Here, I will give you more space on my lap to lay down. So lay down. <laughs> He's such a large cat. Will you lay down, please? It would be very nice of you. Yeah. Okay, go team. Go chat with Bianca. <laughs> While I try to... Raul's just been standing out here in the rain. Okay. We gave the gift to Mangle, and then he just was like, hmm. I've lost my purpose in life now. <laughs> Winter and fall for the pomegranate steeds. Well, you're already wet and outside, so you may as well come harvest everything. He wants to mount a fish. We can mount another one of these. A wall of mounted angelfish. <laughs> we have so many of them. Oh. Bianca's gonna go put that in the dishwasher. She's gotta go pee as well. I wish you could have an option to add it to the queue or replace with in the queue, because I kind of wanted her to... Oh, cheeseburger's getting on in use. I wanted her to finish putting that in the dishwasher. It just did not happen first. He's gonna make a ridge port. Okay. Raul is in the process of taking care of the plants, and then we'll have to um, come take care of cheeseburger. 
for what I keep thinking is going to be the last time, but it keeps he keeps living through these streams. He might be as immortal as um, Donnie and Monty and Monty, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, Bianca. Bianca? She's showering in the rain. Okay. I was wondering why she was naked. Um, <laughs> can you not? Just, like, standing with your ass out to the whole front, whole world. Mangle's gonna see. <laughs> oh, Mangle disappeared in front of our front yard. Okay. Vikram's wa <laughs> Wait a minute. Vikram's watching through the window like, what the fuck is she doing? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, the baby's crying. We should take care of that. Why is the baby crying? Let's feed the baby. Bounce the baby. Vikram, don't go wake the child. Oh, the child is already awake. Never mind. Child has hunger and has to poo. Well, you're going the wrong direction for one of those. Go potty. I will bring you food. Oh. I really thought we had more food in the fridge. Vikram should get cooking. Look at him speed walking with his max movement skill. I think this is the best I've ever done for a toddler, by the way. He is maybe going to max out three skills. One of them being potty, which has no bearing on the rest of the game at all, but... <laughs> he independently was max level of potty. A new username. Would well, do you want to keep with the twisted thing? Or are you going, like, full-on new direction? In which case, it should be new directions, which was the, the name of the choir in Glee. Um, just because I remembered it when I said New Direction. <laughs> but it's true. That is what they named themselves. The New Directions. <laughs> Change Dirty Diaper. Okay, maybe that as well. Raul is done taking care of Cheeseburger and can... Um... You know what? He has not painted in a long time. He can come do a abstract painting. She's done taking care of that. She wants to mourn the dead from being gloomy. Alright, well, <laughs> calm it down, girl. Um, vibes like he's not a ni nice person. Mm. Something nice and sweet. Hmm. I'm not going to lie. I am not good at thinking of names. It is why I um, have used the same usernames for many years at a time. <laughs> for everything. Welcome on in, Aimless Stammer. Aim aimless Stammer? Don't know which one is correct, but they appreciate the follow. Thank you very much. How's your afternoon? Um, Vikram, are you just watching the toddler go to the bathroom? You should not do that. You should go cook, I guess. Actually, yeah, you go to work in two hours. You can you can cook a meal in that time. Cook a gourmet meal. Cook some herb crusted salmon. Keep it along the lines of food. Mmm. Popcorn. Mmm. Yeah, 
you could do um this is maybe a little niche <laughs> um, but you could do popcorn kernel but kernel spelled like c-o-n-o -O, uh, the military kernel <laughs> however that's spelled i can't spell it out loud <laughs> colonel this this type of kernel which i'll never understand why that's pronounced kernel um uh, but the debug items you can place wild rabbits <gasps> we could get donnie oh my god we have to do that right now i've been meaning to dig through debug anyway um because i know there's a lot of stuff but if we can bring donnie back to life i think i will <laughs> How do you do it again? <laughs> Isn't it like um, show hidden objects or something like that? Hello? Okay. BB show live edit objects. Show hidden objects first. Okay. And then bb dot show live edit objects. No, maybe I typed the first one wrong. Test, test and cheats, yeah, probably. Oh, I'm typing it in the wrong one. <laughs> Testing cheats true. And now it's not typing. We love to see it. I swear to God. I usually type true as T-R-U. And I, I sometimes struggle to remember that there is actually an e in the word true <laughs> like i'll be typing it for something like this where i it is imperative that i spell it correctly and i will have to stop for a moment and be like right t-r-u-e e <laughs> there is one kernel popcorn yeah you have to use the capitals ah uh, see i haven't been using the capitals because um <laughs> I I don't always include them. I don't I don't do it for hitch, uh, BB move objects and it just it I don't even type BB move objects on I just type BB dot move objects and move, and it turns it on for me. Um, but that one worked. Ah. <laughs> That's such a weird noise. Uh, <laughs> BB dot show live edit objects. Did that work? Yes, yes. Debug objects. Oh my god, we have so many. What is this? The sum of all birds. <laughs> I love it. I think we need one in the house right away. Hold on a minute. <laughs> this feels like, a honestly, a piece of art that we need in the art gallery portion of the house. Just little, little, oh, you know, I didn't even turn on BB move objects. I did, yes, we're looking through it now. Uh, the first thing that I found, the literal first thing, was the sum of all birds here, um, which I love and I think we need in the house immediately. <laughs> How, uh, what did the vet say, though? Is is Mr. Philbert all right? Not usable, but it would look cool. You know, the original um, picture that I used for the... Um, 
inspiration for this house has a garage um, where Connor and Raul's room is. So maybe we could include a nice car out front of there. Oh, right. I forgot that you can't clone these. Going with popcorn, but not, not what to put with it. His pupils are different sizes. Interesting. No, I hope he's all right. If they're not concerned with uh, with it, that part of it, then hopefully, hopefully things are all right. I love this tree. I kind of want to put it down somewhere, even though it looks disgusting in this um, season that we have right now. It's very hard to pick up as well. Um, we'll put it maybe over here. Wow, that's almost as tall as the house. A nice bridge. Ooh, we could have a bridge for a uh, cheeseburger, of course. <laughs> Just eye drops, fingers crossed, yeah. About his pubic, what? <laughs> Purple popcorn? Hmm. You were paying attention to chat. I also, I missed a lot in just the like second that I wasn't paying attention. Oh, this is a nice tree. It's kind of huge, but... We have a lot to dig through. I can't get, like, caught up on just one thing, you know? A lot of bushes and stuff. Ooh, this is a really nice tree. I can't get caught up on all the trees, though. Okay, I'll be here forever. <laughs> oh, that's like Christmas lights. Feel really stressed now, yeah. Hopefully it's nothing bad. It, if it's not making him, like, act any different, then more than likely he's probably okay. That's what I would think. But it doesn't make it less scary. I also would be, would be scared and stressed. So I don't blame you. Uh, I wonder where the rabbits are. Ooh, I like this little mushroom. How do, how well does that size up? Ooh, I like that a lot. Build a little mushroom forest at some point, maybe? A car. The car looks so tiny in comparison to the house. Ooh. We got these little gates and everything. A well. That's cute. Pupils. Oh, I see. I see. We should definitely have one of these. Right here. Because that just makes sense. Um, is this a log? Ooh, I like the log. Something about me, I just love logs. What is this supposed to be? Moss for a bridge or something? <laughs> ooh, ooh, we have special little gravestones now. I could go back and I could make, um, I could make different headstones for Donnie, Monty, Monty, and everybody. It makes your stomach hurt, yeah. When I get stressed about a, uh, one of my pets, it's like literally all I can think about. I, I'm i very obsessive over the health of my pets. <laughs> I hope he's going to be alright, though. 
I'll keep them in my thoughts. Ooh, we can make a nice graveyard now with these. Is that like a little spice rack? I don't know what it is, but I do kind of like it. Yeah. Is he not home? Does he, like, not know the news? Or what do you mean you're waiting on him? We could place a fox. We could have good old Tom Wilde here. Well, there's a lot of different rabbit things here. That's good that we could probably put these in the graveyard instead of just the, the rabbit um, bushes and everything. Got like a box of onions. <laughs> Various different rocks and a flagpole. Oh, we have a lot of beds. We've got bunk beds and stuff. That's nice. A hockey match. Oh. So much more furniture to clutter with. Yeah. I'm excited. I love um, Plant Lot Animated Gen 1 placeholder name. It's a pretty good plant. A lot of this, I think, is just different swatches of uh, stuff that already exists, because I do recognize some of them. Like, this is the dining chair that I have near the um, the chess table in Connor and Raul's room. We have a lot of different dining tables and stuff. I'm not going to go through all the tables and stuff right now, honestly. That's cute, though. A nice little shelf. A hound stopper wall piece. What is this? I still don't know. My house is too big. I can never tell what anything is. <laughs> That's my favorite name for a plant, yeah. Ooh. Vet fees are so freaking expensive for no reason. It's because they know that you'll pay it. Like, I'm guaranteed that's what it is. I'm guaranteed that's what it is. I'm I'm a hundred percent sure that that's what it is. Cause otherwise, there's no good. There's no goddamn reason why like just just asking like, hey, what's wrong with my pet should be so expensive, you know? <laughs> the Dutch Hutch. You're home. You're home. You're home. Entryway shelf. I love it. <laughs> we should maybe have that in the entryway. No, we don't have room for it in here. Unless, actually, will it fit here if we alt place? Kind of. I don't like it, though. Houseplant hobbyist shelving. That does kind of sound like my deal, like my shtick. More things to clutter with. Mm. Put it there, I guess. 
the nice black swatch. Perfect. A Dutch oven is when you, um, when two people are in a bed and one of them farts and then takes the covers and, like, puts it over the other person so they, like, have to smell your fart. Um, <laughs> as far as I remember, that's a Dutch oven. Bob's Protective China Cabinet. That's kind of cute. It's fucking huge, though. I don't think I have... Wait a minute. We don't have to have this computer here. Oh, that's cute. I like that. And then this can be... Um, Maybe over here? No, I don't love that. Oh, no, I didn't want it, just the computer. The whole desk, please. Hmm. You know what? No. Oops. Right here is perfect for this. Okay, perfect. That was a lot of work just to include a china shelf that's non-interactable. <laughs> I love new furniture. We gotta fit it in somewhere. A ladder case? This is just like a bookshelf. We have so much wall space that we could put it, we could put it on pretty much any wall, but um why does that not Is it a, a floor bookshelf? No way. That's not on the floor. Why does it slot so low? Does that just look low cuz we have tall walls? <laughs> cuz that's really low. Like, here would be good. If we center it like that, and then move this over, like... that. Charles, you are kind of um, all over the place today with where you want to be. Do you want to be in the room or not? <laughs> cats. This is just like Susie used to do this to me all the time. She would come in, she would make a big deal about the fact that she was here now, and then she would leave. And then five minutes later, she'd be like, let me back in. <laughs> it's it's the cycle of cat life. Um, that's a sink. That's a weird sink. A hostess station for when I'm building a restaurant someday. The in-house outhouse, of course. A lot of showers and stuff. The wooden bathtub. What is the medicine craftomatic? I'm sure it you like make vet treats or something with that. Probably. I wonder if there's, like, new hobbies in here that aren't in in regular thing that I can, like, get. The gaming mat, I know, is base game. Um, the motion sensor game mat. Oh my goodness. There's a bunch of rinks and stuff. A bower. A weather control device. I don't know if we should go that far. Hmm.
we're probably going to have to get a chicken coop sometime soon, because we're probably going to get chickens once um, Cheeseburger passes away. Maybe. I don't know. Damn, so Debug really has, like, everything. Like, everything, everything. <laughs> um, probably Get Together and City Living. Um, and then, um, when the new one comes out, of course, Growing Together as well. We have all these art things that are mostly locked. Mirrors, curtains. I sort of forgot why we were in here at first, but I remembered. We're here to find um, Donnie. The potential of placing a Donnie down in the world is too great. Too hard to withstand. But I have yet to see a rabbit. Mystical popcorn. Mm. Yes, I figured they were. They'd be good. Yeah, that's that right there. Okay. Wow, there's a lot of trophies in the game. Clutter, of course. Some good debug clutter. Point redemptions for a Sims build? Mm, maybe. Maybe. I, at some point, I'm going to do something other than a legacy challenge every day, too. Um, I'm just so obsessed with this family. I can't not play them. <laughs> um, but I'll do, like, building streams and other stuff like that at, when I'm in a building mood. And we'll build apartments for some of the people that we move out, maybe. John just got, like, a random house, and so did Kelly. Um, but not everybody will just get some random house. We'll eventually have to build one, or get one off the gallery. <laughs> I still see no rabbits yet. I saw the fox, though, so I do, like, know that they're in here. The tiki neon sign. Actually, that's kind of funny. We could have that near the drinks and everything. People have that sort of thing near their, like, drink places, you know? <laughs> mm, no, I think I like the blue one a little better. That's cute. I like that. I know. No, I don't think I'm going to end it, honestly. I the more I think about what I want to do when this when this um family has reached its 10th generation, the more I'm like, no, we can't just end it. We can't just say goodbye to this family. <laughs> oh, we could have that hanging up in Rubble's room. He likes fishing. Decorating his room like he doesn't have, like, a week left to live. But. You know what? It's fine. I like that one. Aging up. Raw, oversized fork and spoon. Hang that above the, the fridge here, of course. Just some wall deco. Make it feel like a proper bar, honestly. <laughs> this is the bar area. This is where you come to hang out, you know? The happy juice barrel. Ooh, 
wait, there's another one. Just as many neon signs as we can possibly put down. <laughs> Maybe this one should be above the bathroom. Or you know what? No, I, I think the, the bird one should go above the bathroom. And this one should go here. So it's like the tree is on either side. And then the parrot above. <laughs> twisted popcorn. Heck yeah. Keep the twisted to let people know who you are still. Polly wants a plate tree. <laughs> We're in bathroom stuff now. I wonder... I'm going to put that down for a moment, because um, I wonder if having it mounted will count as um, having the fish for Raul to complete his um, his aspiration. And I don't think that's cheaty. <laughs> he deserves it at this point. He's gone fishing so many times in his life. He deserves a nice... Um, Oh, we could buy all the sugar skulls as well. <laughs> I don't remember what you do with those, but we could do so. It feels very trub Club Tropicana, yeah. <laughs> I love the mounted batfish, actually. That's so funny. Like, it hanging off the edge of the thing. See, the mounted anglerfish I know we haven't had, so we'll put that down. And we'll put those into Raul's inventory. Um... Just to get him to complete the aspiration. We could also get any of the frogs that we want, which is cool. Good to know at any time, you know? Sometimes you just want a frog and you don't want to have to lurk, look for it, you know? And we can have a sun surfer frog, say. Anytime. A pigeon feather, I know. So I guess there's, like, something in the game about feathers in that case, because why else would we have all these feathers? Um, but I don't, I have no clue how to get them or what they're about. Debug little egg eyes, I guess. They look like eggs at first. Large space rock. This is the only space rock that I didn't get. Um, but I'm not going to cheat for that one. Just for Raul's aspiration, because otherwise I feel like I failed him in his life. No, this is the only one I didn't get, the unnaturally large one. Maybe we'll put it down. Maybe we'll just cheat that at getting that, because Connor went to space so many times. Oh, whoops, did I accidentally... Oh, no, this tree is just larger than I thought. Okay. Goodbye, tree. Hello, unnaturally large space rock. <laughs> Vikram could collect feathers, maybe... Hey, Cornelius, I love Diablo 3. I hope you're having fun playing. I appreciate the lurk. Um, I've never actually collected feathers, but I used to pick them up all the time as a child. But I, I never got sick from them or anything. But I know that birds do often carry diseases, so that was probably right of your mom to, to yell at you. <laughs> Mm. 
can we just buy a vending machine of the um the vet treat things so we can just always have a vet treat thing <laughs> that's so funny We're not even halfway through debug yet. This is crazy. Maybe I'll scroll just a little faster. But I don't want to miss Donnie if, if we can get him, you know? If we can place him back down in the world. Illuminated succulent terrarium. Oh, that's cute. And it actually is illuminated. A rich sim thing, I know. <laughs> a marauder demon hunter. Yeah, demon hunters were the best. I also really liked wizards, I'm not going to lie. I thought they were fun. Um, but demon hunter was the way to go. Terrestrial sources. The Penguin TV. Ambient wall light. Oh, interesting. So you can just like... Oops. Interesting. Except it does not seem to fit on a wall ever. <laughs> Always play monks. Monks were fun too. I liked a monk. We can get the robot vacuum. I kind of don't want it. I've heard that it is kind of bad. We got bookshelves galore. We're getting down into the plants again. Kind of big brain. Mm. Laundry in the basket are oh, they are slacking. <laughs> And what's funny is they did laundry this morning, too. Um, so they are slacking, but they also are definitely not. <laughs> what is that? Is that a lime? Can I put a lime on the counter? <laughs> I love it. Um, just, just one little lime next to the fruit bowl. And what's this? I cannot say I know. A single red rose. That is a huge ass rose. Yeah, I've heard that Bust the Dust was not so great um, because you do have to constantly be cleaning. Oh, this is cute. I could never have it in a yard because it's so freaking huge, but I like it. I could just have a little a little home away from home in the backyard. <laughs> just a little shack in the back. Um
Hmm. There's a lot of whole buildings in here. I have to wonder, though. They are fake buildings. There is nothing inside of them. I think, right? Yeah. They don't seem to have anything inside of them. A whole house. <laughs> Multiple whole houses. Half a house. <laughs> Just the house outsides. <laughs> A nice cutting board. A telephone pole. Tomatoes. Hmm. Still no rabbits. We'll find you, Donnie. We will bring you back to life. Oh. Drink cup large fail, Jen slushy fail. That's my favorite drink. <laughs> A whole house for zero dollars. But the the trick is you just kind of disintegrate once you enter it. You're not you're not alive anymore. <laughs> um Until you come back out, of course. In which case, you reintegrate. Baby Jen. <laughs> I could just put a baby in the world. <laughs> just a T-posing baby. <laughs> for zero dollars. Who needs science babies? We have baby Jen. <laughs> baby Jen 1. A whole line of rabbits different colors. I haven't seen it yet. But I, I, I believe you. I know it's there. <laughs> I saw the fox. Um, so it's got to be popping up soon. What is this? Why is it so tiny? Just some cupcakes. Oh my god. Some of these houses are nice. Oh my god, this is freaking huge. What even is this? Is that a bowling lot? It just says debug. Cool. There's a lot of items in debug that you would probably never need to place. Like, more than likely. A little terrifying, the T-posing baby. I think it's great. <laughs> oh, you know what? Here's the line of fish. This is perfect. Tilapia tree fish. Raul has absolutely never had a tree fish in his inventory. We can sell these. And we'll put that in Raul's inventory. Just to complete his, um... His fish thing. Oh, this is kind of cute. A little, like, book stand display. Not the pet grave in the inventory. Cheat, I know, I know. <laughs> 
what can I say? I just want Raul to achieve his life aspiration before he dies, okay? Everyone else in the house has gotten to achieve at least one. Um, and we've had Raul out there fishing in the rain. We've had him spend entire days fishing. We've had him going to the spot where you can catch the fish where you can get that I need to get it. And he just hasn't ever caught it. So I feel like he's earned it. And it's not that big of a cheat to just have Raul finally achieve it, you know? <laughs> it's not like we've we've lack of tried and I'm just like, oh, he should achieve it at, for no reason, you know? We've tried for this poor man, and I think he deserves a win, finally, in his life before he passes away. <laughs> um, we could just put a fake cat. That'd be nice. <laughs> We could put the magical bean portal tree. Just right next to cheeseburger. In case we ever wanted to get the plant sim thing. Oh my god. There's so many graves. We can make a really nice graveyard. What is this? That's like an epitaph to a cat. He worked really hard. Yeah, he deserves completing an aspiration. <laughs> Charles, I swear to God. I know I was talking about getting a fake cat, but I meant in-game. <laughs> I could never replace you. Hello, Charles. Would you like to come hang out once again? The third time this stream. You are so weird. So strange. Yes, they. I think they would look good in the graveyard. These little, like, statue things. And some of the graves, honestly. Because we just have, like, three of the same grave for, like, um, Milkshake and all them. Oh my god, we can have different ones, even. A dog and a cat. That's so cute. What are these? Oh, that's a whole house. Yet again. That's a nice one. Uh, we can make a nice graveyard with all these, like, monument sort of things that we've got in debug. Ooh, and this. I like that. That's really cute. It's funny that just that square in the center is what it's considered as, uh, like, having placement as, you know? <laughs> but <laughs> it is really cute. We could have that as an entrance to our backyard, maybe. Want well, the statues in real life, yeah. <laughs> I'll come back for that, maybe. What's it called? Debug. Great. I'll remember that. <laughs> um, I wonder if there's a better way to sort through these. Or if you, like, have to scroll through every time. More art for our art museum, of course. A sword. Just in case we ever need it. Piles of money. Actually, that might be useful to decorate a criminal and a kleptomaniac's house. Um... There's one of the wild rabbits. Not the correct one. But we, we are closer than ever before. We're closer now than ever before. 
You guys ever seen Emmett Otto's Drug Band Christmas? <laughs> I love that movie. Some nice windows. Ah, Donnie! I think this one was Donnie. And he gets a prime spot front and center in our art museum, I think. He's back. I, I'm i kind of wondering, though, it says he's a wild rabbit. I don't know if that means he was, like, an actual object or if he is an actual rabbit. I guess we'll find out. Um... Having a laptop is nice, yes. It is pretty unmatched. That's why I went for a laptop, honestly, when I got a gaming thing. Oh, I love this mossy snail. I'm using that in the graveyard. Absolutely. <laughs> We're, I'm coming back with that. Um, we could get a giant red X. That's great. Um, and these are all the flower arranging things. More rocks. We've got rocks galore. Is that rainbow poop? A wild rabbit in the house, honestly. <laughs> Truly living the dream. I hope you can name it too. I figure you probably can, because that was one of the only things I could do with Donnie, even, even when he was glitched out, was I could rename him. Um... But I do not know. I am unsure as of right now. We're getting to the end of these things here, though. Golden poop. Oh my god. I feel like the pet randomizer should have done more that it did not. Donnie didn't have any clothes, because I bought the clothes after he glitched. Um, but we'll see. Oh my god, I didn't know you could have a rainbow llama. Oh, I know about the rainbow cow. We've had the rainbow cow. We could put a cow plant just fully formed. <laughs> and a money fruit. Interesting. All right, well, that's, uh, that is all of the debug combed through just for Donnie. Worth it. No worries, Cozy. Keep me updated about Philbert. Let me know when you know. I'm worried about him, too. I hope he's all right. Oh. So he's like a, wheel, a real rabbit. I don't think he is a, um, like, fake one. I think he just lives here now. <laughs> we have a rabbit in the house. Donnie, too. Oh, and I can't rename him now. Oh, yeah, I can. Donnie, too. Um, and I kind of forgot where we were. What was happening here? What's everybody up to? And Raul, would you like this fish in your inventory? Can I not pick it up? No! <laughs> That's so stupid. Hold on, let me sell all the things that I can sell. We can't even interact with the fish. 
I do not like it. Back to build mode. That is unfortunate. Um, I wonder if in that case I can do the mounted one. Because I know you can put these in your inventory. I wonder if that'll count. It does not. Can you unmount a fish? You cannot as well. I wanted Raul to complete this aspiration. Where was the fish again? In the kitchen? In the kitchen items? <laughs> I don't know about that. Wouldn't that be under, like, activities, probably? I don't even know. Well, maybe we just can't get the fish right now. That's fine. It is what it is there, I guess. We can't cheat Raul's aspiration complete. He was going to go make a painting. Instead, he's going to go eat. And then he is also going to clean and finish doing the laundry. Vikram is going downstairs to cook. Bianca is coming downstairs for no particular reason, so I guess she can go hack. Make a virus or something. And the child is pooping and gonna eat. Oh, except that this is all spoiled now. Just kidding. Don't eat that. Oh, right. Hold on. Throw tantrum. Yeah, that's fine. You can throw a tantrum. I did sort of forget to get you new food. New food for you. Is this expired? No. Is this expired? No. Let's give some cheese to our infant. Take some of the floating cheese. Perfect. Eat said cheese. And then how old how much longer are you a toddler? One more day. Okay. Does that mean tomorrow? Yeah, today is apparently Jasper's birthday, and tomorrow is, um, I almost said Connor. Blake. <laughs> I can't remember the names this generation. Raul, I'm sorry you're uncomfortable. I was trying to complete your aspiration, though. That cheese, like, barely fed him. He can come get some communication, though. He's allowed to leave the room. He can come hang out with Raul for a little bit. 
talk about art. Say nonsense. You know, just regular toddler stuff. Talk about toys. Vikram's gonna go to work in a minute. He wants to buy an object worth $500. And enthuse about the thrill of the steal. Don't we all? <laughs> Instead, he's just gonna stand paralyzed in the kitchen. Executive dysfunction. We all know it. We all love it. Why do you love eating in your room, Raul? Oh. Maybe, yeah, don't dry laundry. Maybe clean the lint tray, then dry laundry. I don't want to accidentally start a fire. Vikram's off to work. Perfect. He's going to work hard because it's the last day before his weekend, so he can chill for the next couple of days. Vikram. Not Vikram. Raul. Do the laundry stuff. You can talk in a sec. Do the laundry first. And now the child is both tired and hungry. So before you go off to bed, actually, have some of this. Rose just doing sit-ups in the kitchen. Nothing abnormal here. Ab. Abnormal. You see? Ahaha. <laughs> um... I guess. Oh, we can evolve the alien growth pod. Beautiful. Tend the garden. There is some stuff that needs tending. <laughs> I'm glad you could enjoy it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Divorced. <laughs> what, from me? You can't divorce me. A child will go to bed after this. I sort of forgot we have an infant. He's been fine all day. It is the birthday, though, so maybe we should come age him up after this. And then we'll build this room into a two-toddler-capable room. Well, actually, a toddler and a child, because uh, Blake becomes a child tomorrow. So we may as well. Actually, I don't think you'll have time to age up the child. You're about to go to work. Raul, do not light the fireplace autonomously. Because I will not remember to turn that off. And you will burn down the house. Instead, you should come age up the child. Beheaded. <laughs> Okay, Bianca, go to work. Your performance is, is not great right now. Um, oh, she doesn't work today. Just kidding. Continue. Oh, did I accidentally, like, exit that out completely? Did that not? Continue making virus. Okay. It's almost Raul's time. No, it's not. Shut up. No. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Died. I can't believe that. No way. 
divorced, beheaded. Jasper aged up. He is a charmer of a toddler. Oh my goodness. We can share the love with other sims. Survived! <laughs> and let's take a look at him. Oh, he's kind of cute. I like his little, like, updo of a hair. He's got the little quiff. He is a little charmer. Tonight, Buttersides Brown's chat, we are live! <laughs> Bianca can now program mobile apps. That's nice. We have two toddlers for like a minute. <laughs> um. So we can, in this case. Get rid of the bassinet. Copy this toddler bed and give it a different color, maybe. Maybe a nice blue one. Um, and then we'll shift these around. Make that one blue. Actually, you know what? This one pink, that one blue. And then hopefully they can still get into bed like that. And boiling. Not a hair, not a head cut. <laughs> um, let's see here. This is not a bed. Why is this classified as a bed? <laughs> we could have um, bunk beds, actually. I don't know if the toddlers would be able to get into those, but it's a possibility. Okay. Raul, you're sort of hungry. You're sort of tired. Come get food. Unload the laundry. Bolin. Oh, I'm sorry. We infected hundreds of thousands of legacy systems, and we made $300 because of it. All right, Jasper is a toddler now, so we have to have him do things. Um, play inside. Just like three times, I think, should be enough. Bianca, would you like to, yeah, I guess come uh, watch your child. Meet your child, maybe. Which of Henry VIII's wives are you? <laughs> Bowlin? What do you mean I didn't pronounce it right? Bowlin? I don't know. Um, teach to talk, not change outfit, no. Why are you sad? Oh, because you're gloomy. Okay, that's normal. You want to become focused? I can do that for you. Come look at this focused piece of work. Jasper acquired the imagination skill, and he's level two of it already. <laughs> B 
Berlin. Well, I don't even know who that fully is. I know I know she's a Henry VIII's wife. I, I would assume she is part of the uh, musical that you were telling me that one time about the Henry VIII's wives. <laughs> but I... That's the extent of my knowledge, so... I'm sorry I mispronounced her name. It is something I've never heard out loud. Oh. <laughs> She wants to talk to herself now that she's focused. Beautiful. We love to see it. The most loved by the public. Uh, she wants to make something of excellent quality. I don't know if Bianca makes anything, though. What, what skills does she have? She doesn't particularly. Um, make a mobile app, I guess. We can have her do that. Raul is asleep and Vikram is about to come home from work, like right now, probably. Oh no, 2 a.m., oh my god. Forgave her killer the day of her beheading. Oh my goodness. A saint. <laughs> Level 3 imagination already. <laughs> Raul is awake all of a sudden. No, you should go back to sleep. Also, does this not count as having completed a collection? Hold on a minute, let me, let me take a look here. Aliens, space rocks. It doesn't count, I don't think. That's funny. Because it hasn't been found yet. How are you doing, Charles? Would you like to leave? Is that what you were telling me? Americans. Yeah, we don't really do history. <laughs> um, not very often, at the very least. That sucks. Well, I have one last place that we could take Raul to maybe get the fish. Um, and we can take him there before we die. We pass away. Once he wakes up today, maybe that's what we'll go do. Or grammar or math, yeah. No, we don't learn anything in school, really. <laughs> we just get thrown propaganda for a good 12 years, and then they call it a day. I'm sorry you're tired, Vikram. You do work until 2 a.m., though. Oh, he might get a promotion tomorrow, though. Or the next time he goes to work, which is Friday. So sad, but so true, yeah. It really is just propaganda of, like, your needs don't matter. You're here to support the workforce. Like, don't ever think about being an individual. <laughs> Essentially. Um, also, the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Don't forget that important piece of knowledge that we are drilled into from a young age. <laughs> How could I ever forget that? Get some babbling done.
Wow, making a mobile app takes a long time. Zoning. Turns out. Uh, um, they're actually both toddlers now. Jasper just aged up. No longer a baby. Oh. I'm going to guarantee that's the opening to a uh, musical number, and I refuse to read it. <laughs> I don't show my theater kid self on stream. Um, it's a decision I made a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, uh, Jasper is a toddler now, and actually Blake is about to be a um, child today. They age up so quickly when they're this young. Bianca's going to be a young adult forever. Because frankly, I'm thinking about maybe having a third child at some point. <laughs> Vikram's already halfway through his young adulthood. Um, you didn't think he would send. <laughs> oh, he just wet himself. That's fine. You can what's that for a little bit. That's also fine. I gotta grab you some food. Grab a serving. Dilbert, why are you sad? It's been a while since we heard a Dilbert song, honestly. Um, I do think we should pamper him on the couch for a little bit. Vikram bought home $280, and he swiped a book. Beautiful. Another thing to add to the storage over here. Chasing the quadruple rainbow is what he stole today. Incredible. You can come go to bed, Vikram. It is 2 a.m. That would make sense for you. Bianca's probably have to gonna go to bed soon, too, just so she has a somewhat regular sleep schedule, because she also is going to get off of work at 2 a.m. We almost missed Dilbert's song. Incredible. <laughs> Bianca. Oh, we're going to that couch to pamper him. I see. I was like, why are you going into your room? You're so hungry. Aww. Oh, Bombo. Baroog. <laughs> Come get some leftovers. Child is doing well with his needs. He's probably going to go to bed after this. Raul. Is uncomfortable because of the morgue-like temperature. It's cold and I have the thermostat te set to cold. That is fair. So, Bianca, before you get food, you could set the thermostat warmer. And then come get food. Ah. 
Raul is awake now, which means I do think I'm going to take him. Actually, we'll see real quick. I'm going to put this in my inventory. See if that completes the, the quest. The collection. Laughs and confused sexuality. It does. Okay. It is truly alive and well. Um, and then we'll put it back out, of course. I wish I could do the same thing with the fish. Unfortunately, I cannot. Um, in which case, though, we are going to take a trip with just Raul. Everyone else can stay here for a moment. Touch up your Twitch. <laughs> no worries, I appreciate the lurk. We're gonna go to the streamlit single here. With just Raul. No, Charles, I'm sorry. You've gone in and out of my room too many times this stream. I'm not letting you out again right now. <laughs> you got a deal. You got to stay in here. Poor tortured cat. This one. This is the tree. Come view this tree. I'm sorry, Charles. This is where you live for the next, like, half an hour. Why does this have sparkles around it? <laughs> View it again. water it do all of those have sparkles around them no interesting we should fish here for a second then once we're done watering the tree Charles abuse, I know. <laughs> I know. This poor cat has to stay in the room with me who loves him. Abuse. Terrible, terrible abuse. <laughs> Chill you out at work? Yeah. Work has been a, a whole place lately. I just, I, something is up with people, I guarantee. <laughs> um... But I'm glad that I can help ease the pain, Nico. <laughs> it is always nice to hear. It's part of what keeps me streaming in the mornings, frankly, is that I know that like it helps you all get through work. And I love that. I wish I could watch people while I was at work. I would do so in a heartbeat. <laughs> mm. I just want to know why this is shining. Fast forward, come on. Okay, he didn't even catch a fish. I will Google it. Sims for shining fish sign. Fish. Oh my god. I didn't type like half of the word shining. I didn't finish the word sign. I didn't put the S in fish. <laughs> oh, interesting. Interesting. Oh, 
Okay, so we should just continue fishing here is what I'm seeing. And we'll enter the tree at some other point, I guess. Yeah, that's that's twisted, Nico. <laughs> Regular old twisted. Oh, did you not want to go fishing? Oops. Go fish. Don't do push-ups. Go fish. Celebrate Blake's birthday with rock and a rock and birthday party. Actually, Vikram, does it have to be a dinner party at a single event? Oh, it has to be at a dinner party event, though. Okay. Well, maybe we'll throw a dinner party tonight and have a gourmet cake and just age up the sim. Um, I think that would make sense. Streams are much better at work, yeah. Makes sense. The best place to enjoy them. Oh, wow. He caught a goldfish. Oh, but the sparkles aren't here anymore. Oh, but they're here for him. Interesting. Cut a beta. We cut a perch. Listen, it's, my, it's not my fault you're exhausted if you are back at home. Get some sleep. I don't know what to tell you. Uh. <laughs> I'm busy fishing with Raul. Just kidding. I think we are going to water the tree and stuff. We're going to go to that other world and get the fish there. We can't spend all day fishing at a place to only get nothing good back, you know? I don't think we've gotten a single rare fish, and that's, like, what we're supposed to get there. Oh, no. Rainbow fish was rare. Chat about the roots. Gentle delete freshness. Flame up a room. Yeah, yeah. Of you. You know I'll be here. <laughs> you know I'll be fishing. <laughs> Doesn't even matter what game. Who's this lady that I'm trying to talk to so bad? She's nowhere near. Ah, explore, finally, yes. That sounds good to me. That's better than my bio, frankly. <laughs> Why is my child not going to sleep? <laughs> I'm not home to take care of you. You need to take care of yourself. Hello, trials. You are very silly. You are a silly kid, am I am? Downstream. Cod pog. <laughs> I actually don't like shooting games. Enter the mist, obviously. Hey, what are you doing? He's being a menace. You're a little menace, Charles. Travel to the Glade. Heck yeah, we did that first time. Why is my child not going to sleep, honestly? <laughs> I'm not home, though, which is why he should be. <laughs> They take care of their needs when they get low, when you're not home, and that's, like, 
that's a need. You gotta you gotta take care of that, my guy. <laughs> poor poor Jasper's gonna get taken away from us. And we're just out here fishing. <laughs> Can I even fish in this pond? Oh, I can. Mm. Heck yeah, we love it. Oh my god, finally! <laughs> we caught the tree fish, we completed the aspiration. Thank God. And now we can go home. We can take care of the toddler. Although, actually, is there anything else here? I don't remember. A basil bush. Snapdragon flowers. Strawberry bush. More places to, to fish. Frog spot. Nothing, nothing important, really. And we can come back if we need to. Yeah, we'll come back. For now, we go back home and we take care of poor Jasper, who is immediately going to have both an energy failure and an attention tantrum. Um, pro fisherman now, absolutely. home alone <laughs> no but that's even worse is he's home alone he's home with both of his parents and his sibling and he's still not going to sleep or getting any attention <laughs> just start fishing it's true it's true well now whenever we need to take care of raul we can just send him fishing <laughs> bum 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 Oh my god, Dilbert's mad too. What have you guys been doing? What is everyone up to? What is Vikram doing? Vikram's watching TV. He's watching an action movie. He's got a pee and also is hungry. Bianca is hungry and is watching TV in a different room, I think. She's watching sports in the living room. <laughs> Um, you should be asleep, and you, I'm surprised, are not already asleep. You're gonna piss the bed, but that's fine. My poor toddler. <laughs> poor Jasper got ignored on his first day alive, entirely. Raul, who's the only one whose needs are, like, semi-fine, <laughs> has been gone for hours. <laughs> oh, is he vet? Is he sick? Dilbert. We can't have a sick Dilbert. Vikram's gonna make a cake today, though, because we have to have, um, we have to have Blake age up. Ooh. And then we will make Cheeseburger live through another stream. It will happen. Vikram, why are you on the computer? Why have you not taken care of your hunger? Go get leftovers. Bianca is cleaning up. That is fine. After you're done cleaning up, Actually, stop. Put those down somewhere. I will take care of it. You can come do the laundry.
Vikram is going to eat, and then he's going to cook. You can absolutely redeem a VIP for Oblio. That was really sweet of you, Nico. That's most of the VIPs on this channel have not earned it themselves. It's been other VIPs being like, this person's a VIP. <laughs> Give them VIP. <laughs> and I love that. I think that's really cute. <laughs> Charles, the VIC, the very important cat, of course. <laughs> well, now you get to save them, Oblio. <laughs> you can do as many um, cat boy lasers or gay lights as you would like. But, Charles, what are you doing? You're not supposed to be on the on there. Slash VIP O B O twenty twenty. Give the points to Nico. No, you don't have to. <laughs> if that's what Nico wants to spend his points on, I am not going to deny him spending the points on it. <laughs> Nobody pays for their own VIP. <laughs> now, Oblio, you get to choose the next VIP. <laughs> See how that works? You pay it forward. <laughs> don't break the chain. I actually don't know how many more VIPs we can have. Um... Also, Twisted, are you... You're on um the other account right now, right? Because I was going to say, you should have a you should have a VIP badge as well, but you don't have any badges. <laughs> Everyone on this channel is so freaking nice all the time. She's going to flirt with Vikram. That's fine. You guys can have a little chat while you're eating. Raul is going to go take care of Cheeseburger. Both the toddlers are fully asleep. Bianca has work today. Vikram does not. Um, so I think Vikram is maybe going to have a dinner party again tonight. Um, Vikram and Bianca maybe? I don't know. I don't want Bianca to miss another day of work, so just Vikram, I guess. Um, we're going to invite both of our sisters and I guess Raul and Bianca. No, just Raul, because Bianca will be at work, probably. I see. I see. Just doing some other stuff for the account. I guess we'll just invite our sisters. A dinner party with just two people. And the caterer is going to be me. <laughs> um, we're going to have it at our own house at um, 5 o'clock. So Bianca can be here for the beginning of it. She just has to leave eventually. We'll have a nice dinner party tonight at 5. Then I cook the knave. This will look for Nina. Mm-hmm. Everyone here is wicked nice all the time. If everybody was like everybody in chat is, the world would be a whole lot better, frankly. You're awake and very sad. What are you sad about? You had a nightmare. Well, go pee. Go piss, girl. And then, um, Vikram can come uh, polish this to perfection so that it is not disgusting. And then Vikram will probably come make a cake after.
afterwards so that we can age up like is there a gourmet cake we can't make it yet Just a regular white cake is fine, I think. I don't think he cleaned the toilet, but that's fine. Still too scared to sleep from that nightmare for another two hours, huh? Well, come get your communication up. I keep them forever. <laughs> I'm a nice person collector, actually. <laughs> no, it's because anyone who I don't vibe with in chat, it is the one area of my life where I have no regrets of just like, you're gone, bye. <laughs> like, work, I have to be, you know, polite and like talk to the people and, you know, be nice back no matter how mean they are this is the one area of my life where i'm allowed to like completely control the vibes if you're just annoying me that day i can i can t time you out you know if you are spouting nonsense i can fucking ban you forever like it takes nothing <laughs> but if you're nice you get to hang out you get to chat you know the roach motel for nice chat <laughs> Well, I hope you don't think of yourself as stuck here, because you can leave if you would like. <laughs> it's the if you would like part that catches most people. <laughs> She's listening to spooky music. Vikram made his cake perfect. We're going to add birthday candles. Cheeseburger is getting on in years yet again. <laughs> putting plates on the most random places and shelves <laughs> too late <laughs> well i'm glad you don't want to leave um blake i guess actually instead of come getting your skills up you can come candles help um with vikram You can do some laundry, Raul. Beautiful. Back down to the cake now. Ro, where are you going? You're going to research gardening. Okay. That's fine, actually. You are level 9 gardening. It would be nice for you to hit level 10 eventually. We have a dinner party in an hour and a half. Um, aren't you a little early, Alexa? <laughs> is she, which one is she? Is she, she's the kleptomaniac one. Um, so we gotta keep an eye on her. <laughs> what are you doing here? And who said you could just walk in? <laughs> She's not even staying. What? <laughs> she walked through the house to the front door so that she could knock on the front door. Everyone in this family is weird. Even the people who I didn't make to be in this family. <laughs> Let's age 
picked up our child and then we'll go let our sister in <laughs> for the dinner party. Um, God, that's so funny. <laughs> our first trait. Um, Self-assured. Okay. I can believe that. And since he's got high motor, I guess we'll go with the high motor aspiration. You know, he was independent, so it makes sense that he's self-assured. And we'll have to see his, um, what he looks like. His outfits. Oh, that's funny. He has the same haircut now as Blake does right now. <laughs> <laughs> Raul, you're already up here. You should come, um, well, actually, you should wake up, and then Raul, you should, um, dinner party starts soon, I know. I am aware. Oh, and you are instantly as tired as possible. So you should come to sleep then. Although I don't think you can sleep on a toddler bed. I think we have to get you a children's bed now. Child bed. Maybe the pink one? Oh yes, this this pink one, because he was a very pink boy, I remember. This is right up his alley. And you can come go to sleep. Um, Bianca's busy making her app. Vikram is doing nothing. He can... Let his sister in early, I guess. She's still hanging around outside. And we have to invite her in, despite the fact that she did just kind of walk through our house to get to where she is. <laughs> we'll talk a little bit with her. Why are you napping on the bench outside? No. You are going to... Um, give the toddler a bath. Because the toddler is having a rough day right now. Um, The game is looking at his needs and being like, you you should learn about toddlers a little bit. They need their needs taken care of. <laughs> the game really said, get good. <laughs> you can stop and go to the bathroom, Bianca. Vikram's doing great, but his dinner party starts in 20 minutes. Raul is tired. We're not going to be able to attend the dinner party. <laughs> you should wash your hands again, probably. Dinner party's about to begin. Okay, so Bianca then. You're going to have to um, listen to the stereo.
And we can turn on some electronica. Raul's busy giving him a bath. Vikram is now in his party wear. We have to thank a guest for coming. And then we're going to have to get right to cooking because we got to cook three gourmet meals. We'll cook a family size of this one. Bianca is going to listen to music. Maybe we'll come get to know Anhi? Anahi? Anahi? You are not going to serve eggs and toast, Raul. You are, in fact, going to come listen to the music as well. And the toddler is <laughs> going to eat and then sleep, essentially. The attention didn't get up at all for some reason, despite taking a whole bath. Okay, go team. Vikram has to come listen to music as well, huh? That's annoying. Which I don't even think he can right now. I'm glad everybody else is having a good time, though. Except the toddler. Poor Jasper is suffering. <laughs> Everybody else is having a good time, though. Discuss interests. Actually, no, don't go watch your child, Bianca. Come get to know your sister-in-law. <laughs> Have drink Sims drink at the same time. Oh. Can Bianca um make some drinks, I guess. Raul can keep the party going. Vikram. Actually, while he's listening to, we can also listen to. And then we'll have three. Perfect. Okay. Have Sims become playful at the same time? That's not going to happen. Who's calling Raul? John! Colin, Foot, and you were... Oh, yeah. Have some casual friend time. I can't believe we didn't invite John to the dinner party. Does Vikram not know John, actually? He doesn't. Oh, my God. So, Bianca, invite John to hang out. And you know what? Invite Cadence to hang out and Martina. Vikram, instead of chatting like you want to, you are going to call Tamil and then make another gourmet meal. 
while we still have time in this parties. Cadence will be right over, John will be right over. Now the real question, will Martina show up? Martina would rather not come. Okay, yeah, I didn't think so. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, make some drinks for everybody, Bianca. Perfect. He's going to go talk with John. Vikram's going to go cook. And call everybody to a meal. Cadence is going upstairs for some reason. Vikram is going to have to um, introduce himself to John at some point, and then also to Cadence. So we'll queue those up. Everybody's coming to the meal now, though. That Dilbert was in the middle of. <laughs> <laughs> Just some good cat salmon. Nothing like it. John and Raul gained a sentiment from time spent together. That's so cute. Raul's tired, though. He's probably just going to have to um, skip the meal and go to bed at this point. <laughs> um, <laughs> Bianca, I don't even know if you need to be making drinks. You go to work in like a minute. And Vikram needs to cook one more thing before this thing is over still. <laughs> Has he introduced himself to John yet? He sh has not. He X'd those things out. <laughs> Bianca, go to work. Go to work. Sorry, Bianca. You actually do have to get your work performance up. I would like you to become level 8 of this career at the very least. For your aspiration. <laughs> For the thing that you want to do. Linda chosen the arch. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not a fire. No. Hold on a mo, hold on a mo. <laughs> okay, just just not okay. Not an actual fire. Gourmet cooking level five, heck yeah. Um, where did our sisters go? Where did they leave? Where did what? I still have to um, cook a whole nother gourmet thing at this event. Well, Bianca's already at her next shift from oh, having a baby, so don't even worry about that. <laughs> I am a little worried about... Is that Dilbert running away? No, that's Todd. Okay. 
I thought Dilbert had just escaped and ran off. <laughs> Okay, stop chatting with John for a sec because you need to cook one more gourmet meal. Just a just a single serving of pasta primavera will do. Okay, there's one of the sisters. Where did the other sister go? And where's Cadence? Are they all upstairs? Okay, she's here. Cadence is just gone. Wait a minute. Okay, so we know John now, which is good. Bianca knows Cadence. Where is she? She's not here anymore. I think she left. Don't eat the prosciutto wrapped asparagus. Oh, okay. oh. I actually want to put that back in the fridge, please. Yeah. Thank you. We have to thank a guest for coming, so in, after we finish cooking this, we will thank Alexa. This is a great dinner party, by the way. <laughs> Everybody's off doing their own thing. My two sisters have been, a, you know, playing on my computer for the last little while. John's just sitting on my bed. <laughs> Perfect. All right, we can end the event once we're done thanking her for coming. Because, I mean, it's about to end anyway. Perfect. And we got a silver, so that's perfect anyway. Level three of the charisma skill. Oh, okay. You should go take a shower. You should leave. Um, and so should the other sister. Wherever she is. She's already on the way out. Perfect. Alexa, you should go. Don't even goodbye. Just go. I want to critique something, so we can come critique this, I guess. Then we can pee, and maybe, um, maybe we'll do another cooking. All dinner parties end up like that, yeah. Was Cadence still here? I thought she left. Oh, she was right there the whole time. Let me introduce myself to you real quick, actually, though. Let me at least meet you before you leave. That was the whole, at least one of the points of the party. Okay, now we can send you home. Bye. Is John still here, actually? He's on his way out as well. Okay, perfect. You don't have to chat with Cadence. So you can go home now. I just want you to know everybody who's in the family, Vikram. <laughs> I 
Okay, you can hang out with Dilbert for a minute here. You can give him a treat. You can pet him. Offer friendship with him. Why are you washing your hands in that sink? I hate when they do that. And she's doing good at work. She's getting her performance up. Empe Chilo. Uh, you know how it is. And we'll have him, um, probably cook something before he goes to bed. Because we're looking a little low in the fridge, if I remember correctly. Oh, uh, we're all right. Some of those are single serving, though. Yeah. Let's make one more thing. Let's make a roast chicken. Wait, now the vets for Filbert to be seen. Well, welcome back, Cozy. You haven't missed much. We had a dinner party. Um... I almost set the house on fire. It was great. We did not. Um, Caden stayed over until 11, even though everyone else had left. <laughs> the child is awake and has hunger and attention needs now. That's no good. Dinner party. We got a silver. <laughs> it wasn't the best dinner party. Um, but it fulfilled what I needed it to do. Which is always good. Vikram's gonna cook real quick. And then maybe go pay attention to the toddler so that no one calls Child Protective Services on us. Finish cooking, Vikram. We've got important stuff to have happen. Then you can unload and put away laundry and then probably uh, go to bed, honestly. We just have to pay attention to our toddler for like a little bit, you know? <laughs> oh, oh, this is perfect, actually. You don't even have to do it anymore. You can. Tell a goofy story. Tell another goofy story, and then you can come get breakfast at 1.30 in the morning. <laughs> oh, he has school now, doesn't he? Oh, no. Oh, he's got to have to do his homework as well. That's getting his social up, though, right? His attention? It's not getting his attention up? Look at his face. He's like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> How is that not getting attention up, but it's getting his social up? I don't understand. Come get food. Bianca's home. She got almost $200. She is tired as fuck. She can go to bed. Vikram is going to fold laundry and then go to bed. Um, actually, Bianca can stay up for a hot second and pay attention to the toddler, I guess. Because apparently it has to be an adult who pays attention to the child. You're going to go get dinner, and you're going to finish the laundry and then go to sleep. Perfect.
Oh, that did get his attention up. That's silly. Oh yes, Blake is a child now, Cozy, if you hadn't if you didn't see that as well. He has the same hair as Blake has as a as a baby, which is kind of funny to me. <laughs> You can do your homework. You're busy paying attention to your child, which is good. <gasps> no! <laughs> Cheeseburger is passing away. Cheeseburger is in the middle of, of dying. He's also dirty and unhappy. His age is one last pet. No, <laughs> Raul, Raul, come, come, put cheeseburger in your inventory right now. <laughs> I can't, not cheeseburger, not in the middle of the night while Raul is asleep. That's so mean. <sighs> okay, well, we have to let that happen, I guess. I'm just, I, Bianca, go to sleep. <laughs> cheeseburger. <laughs> Poor cheeseburger. Okay, they'll go play. He's gonna do his homework. She's gonna go to bed. And cheeseburger's gonna get taken away. Rip cheeseburger. We don't even get a grave or nothing. Oh, but at least he, like, pets the cow. <laughs> cheeseburger! Oh, but this is the Grim that we know. He's been working a lot lately. We should maybe get to know him a little better. I don't know where he's going now, actually. I think he's coming inside. Where are you going, buddy? He's gonna watch some sports! <laughs> Kill my cow and then just act like nothing happened? I don't know, guy. That seems a little rude to me. Alright, but I actually, I was going to end it um, when Bianca got home from, home from work, but I got distracted by um, everyone else waking up at 2 a in, in the morning and then by Cheeseburger passing away. So, I think this is where I'm going to end this stream. I'm going to kick Charles out from underneath me so I can stretch. <laughs> An eventful end to the stream, if you ask me. Um, a nice dinner party. Yet again, De you know what? It's Death was mad that we didn't invite him, so he came and took cheeseburger from us. That's what I'm going to go with happened today. Um... He didn't go for a Mackey's, it's true. It's true. <laughs> uh, I can't believe it. We no longer have cows in our life. We have to go murder Juliet Ship over this. Honestly, I, it's, it has to happen next stream. Um, but I have some things i got to go get done with my day real quick before I continue playing Sims for the rest of it. But there should be a second stream later on today. I, um, I'm going to go to the gym I'm going to go do my grocery shopping for the week. Uh, and then I will be back later on to continue the story. For now, uh, if you are still here hanging, lurking, chatting, vibing, any of those things, all of those things, thank you very much. I appreciate you. Um, Charles appreciates you too, even though he's trying to get out right now. <laughs> Hello, Charles. Yeah. <laughs>
you keep him in all of the good kitty treats as well. So, but for now, thank y'all for hanging. Thank y'all for chatting. I hope you have a lovely, lovely rest of the afternoon. Lovely evening if I don't catch you later on. And until the next time, guys.